What is happening, YouTube? Cowboy here, and welcome to Vampire. Now, this is a game we have been waiting quite a while for. For those that have been following it, this game was actually supposed to come out back in November 2017 and got delayed all the way to now. Um, so, pretty excited to finally get hands-on with this. For those that have no idea what this game is supposed to be, because it did kind of fly right in under the radar, uh, we're basically going to be playing as a vampire in 18th century London, and the main gist here is this is a game of choice and consequence. We're going to be going through the game, choosing you know, what citizens we feed on, what citizens we spare, and there's very much like a web of fate type thing where everybody is linked together in one way or another. So it should be a pretty good time. Let's jump into it. I uh, did a quick test just to ensure we're sitting at a nice, cozy 60 FPS. Was trying to do this series in 4K, but can't quite pull off that 4K 60. So instead, y'all will have to be okay with 2K 60. My apologies, but no, it's all right. Anyway, enough talking. Let's get things kicked off with Vampire. Twelve dreams for the Red Queen under crown of stone. Eight voracious beasts born from eight restless nights. Four nails piercing the flesh of the sinner. One prayer for the summoned called by this song. Tis perhaps the countdown to oblivion for the once proud city of London. Tis perchance her inhabitants last dance alone to face death and pestilence. Confronted by the eerie and unknown, mortals became desperate for answers. A flock's flight makes for an omen, the falling of a star, a dire presage. Turning to priests for interpretation when there was no reason to be found. When religion failed, men turned to science. I saw them build such vain cities, crafting machines made for endless war. New questions flourished as old answers withered. What is darkness? but lurking sun? What is wall but enslaved stone? What is glass but tortured sand? What is song but a call to arms? What is hate but jilted love? What is life but death pending? Death. Since the apple was plucked from the sacred tree, mortality was believed to be God's punishment. A righteous snare to keep mankind from ascending to the stars. They were all so wrong. Death is not a wicked thing, nor some holy retribution. A true punishment would be to never know its sweet. in a pit with people or something. I guess this was a, a death pit when they threw all the infected or something like that. Thirsty. 
Mary! Oh, no. Mary! Hold on. Please, hold on. Probably just turned. Judging uh, uh, from the puncture and blood stain on his neck. Sisters, well, not eater, but you guys know what I mean. Jump up, nope. All right, I guess we're still this on that kind of plot, scripted plot for for a bit here. Let's follow the path. No, please stop. I mean you no harm. What's going on? Oh, Mary, what have I done? What's all this about? Shit, where'd it go? Now, I can defend myself. Kill that thing! Who are you? Stay back! Sorry, but you left me no choice. Take the, uh, little toggles off my controller. D dashes. Who are you? On. Stupid beast! Oh, what the fuck? Sorry. Harm. I I need help. Die, you fucking leech! Huh. Please, listen to me. I, I can't make any sense of this. Shut up, beast! Who are you? What is this all about? Ah! ah what in God's sake! I'll do the rest ah, of the job. Ah, ah, just, just leave me! Ah, 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 ah. Yep, definitely freshly the turned. Sun. It feels like it's burning me to the bone. Doesn't even realize he's a vampire yet, or... I need to find somewhere to hide. Let me go! Find shelter. Is anybody there? What is this place? The place seems abandoned. 
I should be safe enough here. This one's dressed up fancy. Let's run through his pockets. Pete in the dead's pockets? Are you serious? I've still a rent to pay. He's got no more responsibilities. What's this? Go watch. Beautiful it is. We fancy it and share the takings. <laughs> I suppose we are undertakers. <laughs> now, give him an eve. impossible wait so was it my watch why does this old lady have it they fence it to her I'm wondering is there some system now where like my dude can uh, like detect stuff based off an object Whoever did this to us, I will find them. Shillings. Ages do not fear the sun or fire, and they do not burst into flames or ashes when they are caught under rays of daylight. But it hurts them good, really good. I've personally chained a vampire to a tree to see what would happen when the sun rises. Its skin blackened in a few minutes, as if it would burn from the inside. Its eyes and flesh melted, and I saw its unholy bones move and squeal as the beast tried to escape all day long. In the end, only a desiccated corpse remained, which started to slowly regenerate when the sun disappeared behind the horizon. I cut its head off to finally destroy it. And when I tried the same test with fire, the bloody leech never came back from the ashes. Fire is our weapon of choice, brothers. To burn the beast is the best way to kill it for good. Wow. Oh. I'm definitely not up against any, uh... <laughs> the guys hunting me sure as hell don't seem like a bunch of amateurs. Should have no reflection. No, I have one. Pop vampires don't get a reflection. Twelve dreams for the Red Queen that sleeps under the crown of stone, that she might linger longer. Her eyes as white as blue. Who goes there? A prayer for the summoned by the warrior storm. A child born from darkness must take scent of his power. Who's there? Are you referring to me? much to accomplish. I still have so much left that needs doing. Killed himself. lost we need to leave and now no. there's time i can save him that's the enemy coming the orders are to evacuate the hospital <sighs> done he'll live 
And now what? We fight. Killing is a hell of a lot easier than healing. Wait, so was this like my gun, my watch? No. My photo? It never got easy. All this shit is mine. Unless it's all just a coincidence that this stuff like happens to match, you know? Which I find that really unlikely. I want to go to bed. <laughs> My health back. It's daytime. I'm a vampire. I should not be out. The sun is high. I cannot leave now. Exactly. Uh, how about you like take a nap or, or sleep or heal your wounds? So, I uh, there we go. Yeah. Uh, probably had to trigger it at the door. I didn't see that before. This makes no sense. None of it. No sense at all. It's a nightmare. That's it. So be it. Try and shoot himself. Ain't gonna work. Rational thinking only. Oh wait, why would I shoot myself? I mean, unless it's like a wooden tip bullet, it wouldn't work anyway. But regardless, I'm not gonna shoot myself. Too much cool shit as a vampire to do. Alright, maybe I have to shoot myself? Usually by now, like, you could, you know, not do anything and it would, uh, it would just go away. This is absolute madness. I've lost touch with the real. Madness it is. As mad as the moon. Contains blinding sunlight into a glowing flesh. Hideout beds allow you to evolve and rest. Spend experience points to level up and improve your vampiric skills. Alright, so. You will block your targets blood in their veins making them defenseless wow that's fucked up it's like some waterbender type shit uh, blood barrier invisible barrier absorbing direct damage until it fades or is destroyed form supernatural move to your target cause damage upon landing <laughs> drain the stamina to fade into shadow drain your stamina to fade into shadows and become invisible to most enemies moving the state will drain more stamina it will exit the shadows if you attack dodge when your stamina is empty and by selecting autophagy. Drain your own blood to heal normal and aggravated damage. And well, I'm going to look at the rest of these before I select that. Well, let me just select this. Oh, there are expansions on each of these two. Damn. 
Uh, all right, hold on. What else do we got? Claws. Close range strike that will cut all living creatures in front of you. You throw a spear made of blood. Place a cloud of shadows at the target's feet or yours. The cloud will explode, causing heavy damage. <laughs> Ultimate. Lose control and let the beast take over for a short time. The beast teleports itself to all enemies around you and strikes flurious blows. Shadow vortex at your target's feet, coming to life. The shadows uh, interrupt an enemy in the area and inflict tremendous damage. You focus your power to boil your target's blood, causing it to explode, dealing damage to the target anything nearby. Jesus Christ. Increase your health, increase your stamina, increase blood capacity, increase blood absorption when using bite in combat. Increase the damage inflicted when using bite, increase life regen when using bite. Three serums or number of bullets you can carry. Okay. Select your first level of autophagy and spend enough XP to win. Leveled up, press B to go back. You now have... And choose one to unlock. Right, you now have enough XP to unlock an aggressive skill. Cost, uh, let's see, cost 25, 220 damage. Recovery 3. Close range, close medium ranged. Shadow Mist. I mean, we're talking strictly damage. That one's 250. But Blood Spear sounds pretty badass. Pass through enemies in front of you, like line them up and hit multiple ones with the spear. Ooh, Shadow Myth, though. I like the idea of shadow damage. Claws sounds like the basic bitch move. I don't care about that. Short time. Two meters. Uh, let's... Oh. Alright, let me look at some of this stuff. Shadows will pool in a single place. All targets within this area are constantly struck by slithers of darkness, causing them to bleed. The vampire will directly absorb the blood. That's badass. Or shadow explosion is longer. I kind of like this. It's like a shadow trap. What about if I go here? What are the evolutions? Throw a large spear of blood. Pass through them. Greater damage than before. Or... Big small spears, which hit all enemies facing you, compared with the base ability range and individual damage is reduced. Looks pretty cool seeing it. And you gain blood with each hit, or stun. So stun or hit. Um, I want to go towards this. This looks badass. Just shadows that pool and slowly tick and hit everything struck constantly by slithers of darkness causing them to bleed sounds really neat belong to the one who made me what I am I must I find him to understand empire who creep what I right uh, well we're gonna wrap things up here rest assured I will have more of this coming your way later today uh, probably gonna be sticking with the good old two episode per day type uh, cadence with this um, if I end up recording a bunch maybe I'll jump up to three a day obviously this isn't gonna be like Dark Souls where I dump out the whole series in three days but either way it's off to a good start which is better than i can say for a lot of the other titles we've been playing lately so good but anyway make sure to stay tuned we'll be catching you guys in the next episode setting out some shadow traps and seeing how things go so we'll catch you guys then